Hello and welcome to Mobile Monkey. I'm Craig and in this video we're going to set up your Facebook Messenger ad. We're going to show you how to set up the widget in Mobile Monkey. We're going to actually create an ad in Facebook and connect it right to your Mobile Monkey bot and then we're going to test the ad. So let's get started. So the first thing you want to do is you want to get your page set up that's going to work with the ad. So for a test here, I just created a page called FB Messenger Ad, and I've used a quick question widget. I've typed a question here, um, save the attribute as go live, and did a multiple choice answer. If they hit yes, they're gonna go to the go live page, which I've set up here. If they say no, they're just gonna go to the welcome page. So in order to set up the ad, we're gonna go to Messenger Ads here on the left. And this shows um, all the ads that you've set up in the past. So we're gonna set up a new one. When you set up new a new ad, you just type in the name that you want, and then you choose the page that it's going to go to. So I set up um, FB Messenger ad. So I'm going to choose that and then you're going to see that it gives us all this code here and this code here. Now this code we need to place into our ad on Facebook. So we're going to go to Facebook right now and you're going to want to create a new campaign and you're going to want to choose messages. Uh, name that campaign. I'm just going to call it Colab Notification and hit continue. That's gonna bring you to this section and here's where you'll create your audience, choose your interests, choose where you want the uh, ad to be placed and all of that. I'm not gonna go into uh, Facebook marketing right now, um, but then you're gonna hit continue and you're going to choose a page that you want this connected with. So I'm gonna choose the digital marketing bot page. And then you're gonna to wanna to choose an image. So I'm gonna to go to free stock images here. I'm gonna choose a monkey. And we're gonna confirm that. It's gonna pull in over here on the right and uh, uh, come visit, come watch us live. Just put a message there. And then you're going to want to hit the show advanced options. If you don't have that, um, it might already be open for you, but if not, just hit that. And you're looking for this URL perimeter. Now, if you go back to Mobile Monkey, you're going to see that there's a URL perimeter here. So we're going to copy that code and we're going to go back here and we're going to paste it in there. So we're good there. Now we're going to scroll down a little bit more here to the messenger setup. Now you're going to want to create your own welcome experience and you're going to want to choose custom template. Once you've chosen that, you're going to want to do create new and then you're going to want to choose JSON. All of this code here is code that we want to replace. So what we're going to do is we're going to come back here to our code from Mobile Monkey. We're going to highlight all that and we're going to copy it. And then we're going to come back here and we're going to make sure that we select all of this text and delete it. Just make sure it's, it's completely gone. Uh, otherwise you're going to have a problem. And we're going to hit control V that's going to paste all the code. As you can see, this is the same code that is in our mobile monkey. So we're good there. And then we're going to, that's all you have to do right there. So now we're going to hit confirm and it's going to create the ad and then we're going to test it. So it should come back here in just a second. And there it is. So we're going to click on it. We're going to go to our pencil here. We're going to go to the ad. And then on this 
Uh, we're going to go to the add. And then here's our add. And then this little thing that says add preview, you're going to want to click on that and choose Facebook desktop news feed. You can also send it to your phone. And then we're going to scroll up. And here you can see there's the ad we created. Come watch us live, connect in Messenger. And I'm going to close that. If we hit send message, you're going to see it did pull up that our message here and the questions right there. So everything is good to go. We can go back to the ad manager and publish that ad and then you're good to go. All right, hope that publish that ad and then you're good to go. All right, thanks a lot.